we're gonna do here is make some rice. So I'm getting a pan of water and we're gonna put it on that nasty stove. See all the water in there? There's the stove. Get a good shot of that stove. It's well cooked on. Well cooked on. And if you get hungry, there's stuff you can pick up and eat while you're cooking. I'm gonna put this on about 100 if it had it, but it don't. Actually, I'm gonna put that on high until it boils. We need rice. Same shirt, different day. So you got, yeah. Hmm? This or this? This. Bam. The beans too. Okay. We're going with some kind of rice for editing purposes. I'm gonna call it John's rice. This is from Cambodia. They keep these people working. Anyway, I gotta open it. Bit. Anyway, we're opening up the rice here. Tastes like crap. Oh, dang, that's tough. Until you cook it. So we got the dirty stove heating up. And uh, what we're going to make is we're going to boil this rice till it gets good and soft. And then we're gonna put milk, butter, and sugar in it. And if you've never had that, you do not know what you're missing, because it is the bomb, bomb. And it's so good that it should be served in every restaurant in America. So, I'm gonna get this water boiling, and I'll be right back with you. Okay. okay. What we're cooking here is rice that we're gonna mix milk and sugar and butter with. But um, if you come over here, the water's starting to boil, and that's what you want, from what I understand. Of course, I'm not a cooker. And I was just also informed that on the side of this box here, that, oh my gosh, I took the <laughs> what the crap? <laughs> You're not supposed to do that. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Uh, oh, we'll scrape all that up and put it in the pan here in just a minute. So, uh, but anyway, watch the rice there. I can't believe I just poured that much rice on the floor. We still have some left. We're gonna dump this in here. <laughs> I slipped on the rice. We're gonna dump all that in there like that. I'm gonna close the box so I don't dump it again. How much rice do you put? I don't know. I just pour it till it looks good. Anyways, uh, I have to get over here. Get this spread. I'm not real sure how much rice to put in there. All I know is it's got to get moist. So we'll pour a little more. And if you want chunks in it, we have cheese, bacon, a little bit of onion, um, grease, toilet paper, in case you really have to go. And uh, anyway, uh, this is a really good rice when you don't pour it all in the floor. But I bet you could eat it off the floor too, it'd probably be all right. We slipped the chickens in. Yeah. yeah. There are chickens outside that we can let in. But I'm gonna get a broom and sweep this up. It's just really hard to walk on. <laughs> Cause I am a dumbass. Anyways, needs a good sweeping. It's probably about five dollars worth of crap I spilled. So, uh, You could pick this up and reuse it. Of course, then you'd be, oh my gosh. 
You don't want that to happen either. Apparently, I don't know what I'm doing. So I'm gonna turn this way down. Way down. Put it on seven. No, six. Six on the deck. I'm gonna put it on six. Bob Vila. Anyway, a nice little pile of rice there. Could let the rats come out and get it, but we don't want to do that. Gotta find a dustpan. Chicken to tear that up. It's hanging on the wall. We have a dustpan hanging on the wall. Now what I'm gonna do is dump this in it. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm gonna put it in here and save it for later. I'm gonna hang this back up. Cause Tammy will kill me if I don't. Anyways, the rice is getting all fluffy and boiling. See, getting all fluffy and boiling. Now you know I can't cook, so I'm experimenting with all of this crap, because I cannot cook. But hopefully it comes out good, because I'm gonna eat it whether it tastes like crap or not. And um, I'm not sure what that is. It looks like a potato, tomato, potato. Get a shot of that. I'm not real sure what that is. What do you think that is? Hmm. Well, I don't want to touch it with my fork. I'm not sure what that is. But I do have this. Some hors d'oeuvres. <laughs> oh. What is it? Don't smell it. <clears throat> oh my gosh. What is it? Smell it. Oh, it smells like sausage. That's sausage. It's sausage. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it smelled good. Anyway, uh, just a little tip for you. When you open your rice and you get ready to pour it and you do discover the directions on the side, make sure that you hold the lid down or you will have a mess. So that's all, I'm, I mean, I figured that out. So I'm gonna put this up and I'm gonna get back to cooking. I really want to put all this in there, but it's probably not a good thing to do. So, stir it up real good, let it boil a little bit, let it heat up. And then when I get ready to put the rest of the stuff in it, I'll be back, back with you. I figured out that minute rice is a liar. They're liars. It took like 10 minutes for that stuff to be ready. Hey, you can't say that on TV, they'll sue us. Okay, well the minute rice took more than a minute. All right. But that's better. Oh crap. Anyways, come on over here. Now we have fluffy right. Fluffy. See, it's all fluffy. Anyways, I don't know what this is called. Redneck mumbo jumbo. And uh, we had a clean stove, but we brought this one in for the photo shoot. <laughs> because it looks more like a cook stove. We'll bring the clean one back in after the shoot. And uh, that's a joke. That's a joke. Anyway. What I'm about to do now is we have sugar, butter, and milk. About to go butter it. Butter. Mmm. Choice fat people. Parquet. Huh? Parquet. I have no idea. All I know is you take big old see this? <laughs> Bam! You do not want to be stingy. Bam! With the butter. Because we have a big old pot. Bam! And you want to kind of chop that up in there a little bit. You want to swirl it around real fast. I'm sure there's a technical name for what it's, I'm doing, but I don't know it. Well, I'm going to call this poor man's rice. Of course, butter is expensive. You can get all the butter mixed up in there real fast. And put the lid back on this. So the flies don't get it. Flies don't get it. Then we got sugar. And I like pink against the white because you can see it better. So you don't have to dig around for the little sugar thing. 
You want to grab a whole cup of sugar. You want to bam, slap it in there. Grab a little bit more. Bam, slap it in there. Put the lid back on because the ants will have a party. How many cups of sugar are there? I don't know. Two or three cups. I don't know. Just whatever you feel. Then you want to pour a little milkage, milkage in it. Then you want to mix it all up. There's more stuff on the stove. That's why we brought the dirty one in. Oh, crap. Get her all mixed up in there real good. I like doing a little whoppy jug. Whatever that's called. And, and you could eat that too, but probably not a good idea. Anyways, that should be the finished product. Shall I try it? Try it. Oh damn, that's good. I think it needs a little bit more sugar. I don't think you can say damn on TV. Yes you can. Put a little more sugar in it. Lid on it. Stir. Voila! Done. Poor man's rice. Right at home.